So today is the fourth, I mean the fifth day of chemo, the fifth and final day. Um, after today, uh, there shouldn't be any more chemo from what I've told, been told. Um, so there's that, that's exciting news. Um, they haven't started it yet. Uh, but I assume they will fairly somewhat shortly, hopefully. Um, the Wi-Fi situation is pretty shitty because I can only get 500 megabytes a day. Which, if this dongle runs out, I don't think it will be enough to upload videos. So, I might have to buy another dongle. Um, plus, I want to watch videos on YouTube, you know. I've been missing out. Um, I'm currently about to upload yesterday's video. It's not a very long video, it's quite a short one compared to the rest. Um, but yeah, it's gonna take a little while to upload. So we'll see how it goes. Alrighty, um, that's the end of day 5 chemo, that's chemo all done and dusted. Now essentially what I have to do is wait for my white blood cells to drop to nothing. So I'm going to have no immune system whatsoever. Um, yeah, so it's it makes it hard because if anybody in my family gets like a little sneeze or a little sniffle they can't come and see me and that's really shitty um, so yeah there's that and that's like that's horrible because I look forward to seeing these people every day and I can't see them at all if, if they end up like this well not like this like a little bit sick and with this cold weather, let's just hope that nothing, nothing bad happens. Um, so then after that they're gonna start, when my white blood cells reach zero, they're gonna start injecting me with white blood cells again to bring it up. And when it's on about 2.3 for like a couple days, a few days. Um, and it's stabilized there, then I'll be able to be discharged. But it takes time for it to come down and come back up, so... Let's just hope this process goes quick. Alright, so I've got the platelets here. Um, it's, the, it's the yellow one, let's see if I can zoom. It's that stuff right there. Ah, shit. You can't even see. Never mind. I'm going to just now. Um. Yeah. Wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. Uh, so, yes, I do say um. Uh, oh, no, now it's being pointed out and I notice it. Uh, the platelets are busy being done and dusted not so dusted yet but they're done and I'm allergic to it the platelets so they're putting this other stuff to I uh, can't react the reaction and then it makes me like super Hello. tired like alright so I don't think I explained properly last night about the platelets essentially what platelets are and what they do is uh, they clot your blood Right, so if your platelets are low, um, it means you can't form scabs and your blood can't stop flowing easily. So some people will bleed internally. If you cut yourself, you'll bleed externally, and it will just like not gush, but it wouldn't stop easily. So the platelets that I received last night, um, it's because my platelet count was low. They wanted to be anything between like 30 point something and 
I don't know, something. Right? But it was on 20 points something last night. So they brought it to me. And I have an allergic reaction to platelets. So essentially my eyes will like start to swell up and itch and it looks like I got stung by a bee or like hit with poison ivy or something. Um, so I have to take a uh, an anti-reaction shot while they just like put into my pipes. Um, and essentially what that is, it makes me super drowsy. I can't think straight and obviously with my parents here, I'm not going to go to sleep. So the whole night I was kind of like oozy off and on. You could tell like in that little end bit of the, well, the previous bit of the video. So I figured I should just clear that up before I uploaded this video.